And we're back. I guess it's time to go collect uh, 30 poes. God damn. Oh man, this is gonna be we're gonna be something else. Man, do I really need to collect all the poes just for a fourth bottle? I'm, I'm, I'm thinking about it now, and I'm like, man, maybe I don't need the pose after all. <laughs> like if I, like if I play a play a Twilight Princess randomizer, I'm just gonna make make it so that the pose guy isn't included in the logic. Fuck collecting pose. That guy is that guy is staying a damn statue as far as I care. Because the most annoying thing about the pose is that you have to collect them at night, which is like really. So, and there's no, like, sun song in this game, so you just have to sit around. Fuck it, I'm not collecting no damn pose. And if I do, I'll just do it w uh, without recording, right? In fact, that's probably what I'll do whenever I'm done recording this episode. And I have some free time, maybe I'll just go collect the pose on my own. Because I don't want to- I don't want to bore you, it's just some pose. Okay, so instead we're gonna go do some other stuff. So, right now we're gonna do the... the Mallow Mart quests. For fun, cause why not? I don't really want the magic armor, but whatever, I guess I'll get it anyway. Just to have it on my damn screen. Should probably turn into a human. Who? Who's looking at me? Nobody's looking at me. A real brain buster, I wonder if that wolf turned into Link or not. Hello there. Long, long ago, I predicted that you come, my brother. But tell me, did you not see my young one in trouble in Castletown? He has been stuck steady there, for he cannot get any hot spring water. Alas, the East Castletown bridge remains broken. Perhaps it's fortune will turn, for it looks like the Malamart is raising money to repair the bridge. This is a fine thing, my brother. Perhaps you might consider a contribution to their fundraising help me and mine. Welcome to Malamart. I've heard from a reliable source that shops in Hyrule Castle Town are gouging prices, crushing folks under the thumb of commerce. Well, if you're not, brother, for Malomad has proposed a townspeople relief plan as an answer to the lamentations of the common man. Phase 1 repair the broken bridge leading from East Castle Town to the field in order to improve traffic. Phase 2 buy that Castle Town shop and sell products to the town at reduced prices. You heard me right, brother. There's a problem, however, the finances for the execution of this glorious plan are lacking. Please, brother, offer some financial support to aid in the purchase of the Castle Town Shop for the benefit of the people. We are 1,000 rupees short of funding for the bridge repairs. We need that bridge for a steady flow of goods. We must bring the cost of goods down in Castle Town, brother. Could you please help support this worthy cause? It's at this point where I kind of wish that I was playing on the uh, Wii U version. Because <laughs> the first wallet you get goes up to a thousand rupees and I probably would have had a thousand rupees straight out the gate now I have to go get 400 from somewhere god damn it I think Godzilla dungeon has a section that tells you where to get some rupees <gasps> wow it's a monster everybody run shut up Just a wolf, dude. Well, there's 200, so that's pretty good. Ah, our castle looks freaking awesome from here. Hooray! Alright, now we just need a hundred more. Here we go. Hopefully I don't mess this up. Good thing I'm on emulator and I can cheat with safe states. Goodbye. Hello. Hooray. Alright, there we go. There you go, buddy. Glorious day, we have collected enough funds to finance repairs of the bridge connecting to East Castle Town to Hyrule for your brother. Those corrupt price gouging shops in Castle Town are officially on notice. Soon they will rue. We hope you'll continue your financial support of our efforts to sell products in the town at discounted prices, brother. Okay, now what? I have only 2,000 rupees <laughs> left. 
we reach our goal of financing a store or <laughs> what okay apparently we can reduce how much this is gonna cost by going to help the goron who uh, built the bridge postman please mr think i've come to deliver a recent letter for you to let us in fact thanks get out of here all right who is this uku Oh, I was so happy to see you the other day. I really had fun. I was also so happy to see my son's face again. So happy! I'd like you to know you'll be heading to another location soon. If you continue on your travels, chances are that we'll meet again. My son and I are certainly looking forward to seeing you again. Take care of yourself. Link, there are some folks I want you to meet. So come to my bar right away. These guys will be powerful allies for you. You heard me. Come by. I'll be waiting at my castle town bar. Tell me. I guess that's the main quest, right? Uh, I do not feel like doing a thing. Now the bridge is fixed, but my body feels terrible. I just cannot go look for this for stuff to sell. You know, all I really need is to shower myself with some piping hot spring water to get back to feeling normal. You made a donation. Do not die far sighted at all things, my brother. Tell me, my brother, do you not know of a young Goron in Castle Town? I suspect he is currently hanging his head somewhere near the East Gate. Here's the plan, my brother. I will prepare some hot spring water, and you will douse that young one to revitalize him. What do you say? Will you do it? Oh, I see. I'm counting on you to make the run, my brother. Hot spring water cools as time passes, so if you do not hurry, you will end up with plain old cold water, my brother. Here we go. Best thing to do here is just run along the south edge and I uh, hope you don't get attacked, basically. Don't worry, his aim is bad, he won't hit me. His aim really is bad. Man, I love the Hyrule Knight theme. So serene and beautiful. Sounds really good in the OOT sound font, which you can um, use for randomizer. You can use custom songs for OOT randomizer, and it sounds really good in OOT. See, is that some Kakariku hot spring water you have there, brother? If you poured it on me, I'm sure it would restore my strength. <laughs> oh my god, my voice. It's gonna collapse into dust doing these damn Goron voices. I've rejuvenated that smell that heat is spring water from back home. Well, I'm going to get back to work and open up the shop. of heart. Hooray! Guess I'll go donate some of my bugs to get some money. Hello Agatha, I'm back. Have you brought a bug for Princess Agatha's ball? Yep. Oh, oh, oh boy, who's your friend? You're a little ladybug, aren't you, you little cutie? Little ladybug, little ladybug, if I was smaller, I would get on your back and we'd fly around. <laughs> oh boy, thank you so much, I'm so happy. <laughs> Oh, oh boy, who's your friend? You're little dragonfly, aren't you? Little dragonfly, little dragonfly, when you look at me with those great big eyes, I... <laughs> Hooray. But we don't have, um, the... It might actually be a female. <laughs> what? We don't actually have the, um, female snail yet, but... But we'll get it later. Let's let's see what she has to say. Little snail, little snail, just once I'd like to take a bath in that slime. What? <laughs> Why? <laughs> That's so weird. Okay, goodbye, Agatha. You never cease to um amaze me for all the wrong reasons. Why am I even doing this? <laughs> well, I guess I wanted that heart piece. Since I do want to collect all the heart pieces at the very least. I mean, I do want to 100% the game, but like... I don't, I'm not... I don't want the magic armor. I'm not gonna buy it right now, that's for sure, at the very least. What? 
You really have to wait for time to pass? Come on, guys. Yeah, for the pose, I'm thinking that I'll collect them just on my own. Maybe I'll still record me collecting them, in the, but like, it'll just be like a hyper cut of me getting them all. I don't think I'm gonna talk while I'm doing it, because pr I'll probably just like, while I'm waiting for it to turn to night, if I, whenever I have to wait, I'll probably like be playing some other game or doing something else while waiting for it to turn to night, you know? I sure hope it turns to day soon, speaking of. But yeah, so that's what I'll do for the pose. Maybe I'll put that hypercut at the end of this video, I don't know. But um, I'll put it somewhere. If not at the end of this video, then at the start of next video. It's finally turning to day. Standing here for quite a while now. <laughs> do I have to wait for day theme to come in? Guess I might as well. There it is. Thanks to all the bridges built, the trade route is secured. We save money from the economic development of Castletown. But in order to reach our Castletown development goal, we still need 200 rupees. There you go. Today marks the day that another legendary establishment is born. You should travel to Castletown later. Thank you for your cooperation, brother. Here comes the damn postman again to tell me that Mellow Mart's open. There's a letter from Mellow Mart. Mellow Mart, the hero of discounts, has finally opened Castletown. We've got all you need for that upcoming trip, and we offer it all at unbelievable prices. Grand opening special, magic armor. Oops, I did not want to equip that. God. <laughs> this music. This damn music. Oh my god, this place is so weird. Stretched picture of Mallow on the wall, what the hell? Song is psychotic. I'll take one, I'll take one, I don't really want one, but I'll take one, by gosh. Sell it. <laughs> Buy one, get one. You want one, then get one. Sell it to me. Well, there's the magic armor. I guess I'll get that at some point. I don't think I can afford it right now. Alright, time to do some mini games. This place is so dark. Greetings and salutations, good sir. Welcome to the kingdom of hopes and fondest dreams. In this place, you can taste the life of a circus star and get your hands on gear that boggles minds. It is our earnest hope that you find a light playing the star game. The rules are exceedingly simple. So all you must endeavor to do is track down all the glowing orbs and collect them all before time runs out. <laughs> Rather outstanding name, I must say. Step right up, shyness be gone, it's only 10 rupees, who's up to the challenge? Many thanks, good sir, the game will begin once you enter the cage, may favor, f may chance favor you. <laughs> good sir, are you at the ready thing? No way we go. They know the claw shot, can just cheat. Don't. <coughs> Impossible. Oh, what a happy day this is. The debut of a new star. Shouts of applause all around. To the star, I shall give this. Hooray. Very well. The next stage will be created just for you, good sir. I would expire should you decline. Please, you must try it when it is ready. <sighs> I shall remember this. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Well, Link has an awesome fan club. What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, look, Agatha's hanging out outside. Thanks to you, I have 21 bugs ready for the ball at my castle. We only need three bugs. More until all of them are here. Please do your best to find partners for the ones that are not already paired up. Here we go, time to get a new skill. <laughs> mm. 
We meet again. Next is the greatest of the hidden skills I have taught you to this point, and it may test the limits of your endurance. You still wish to master it. Very well. But before we begin, I must m test you to ensure you have mastered the last skill I taught you, the backslice. Now then, come at me. Get on. Excellent. It appears you are certainly capable of performing my lost dart. Very well, my fourth hidden skill is the Helm Splitter. Let it be hewn into your mind. It is impossible to circle around and perform a backslice against fully armored enemies that move swiftly in combat. Against such foes, you must first use a shield attack to make them flinch, but then quickly press A. You will leap into the air over the enemy's head and greet them with your blade by immediately striking from behind. This is the Helm Splitter. Show it to me. Just like, uh, just like in Wind Waker. <laughs> Get down. Mm, impressive. Do not miss your chance to land a helm splitter with A after your shield attack. For thin skill, the helm splitter has been passed on. There's still three hidden skills for you to learn. Do not neglect your daily sword training between now and the time you come to learn the next skill. May we meet again. Alright, there's some, some, a few more things we can do, um, right now, before, you know, moving on to the main quest. A lot of the things in this, like, guide on Zelda Dungeon for all the bonus goodies, a lot of it is, like, stamps for Miiverse. <laughs> Which, um, obviously, they're basically useless now, since Miiverse, like, doesn't exist anymore. <laughs> But they, they're still there in the guide in case you want to get them for some reason. Uh, I, I, I do wonder if they release this game on Switch, what are they gonna what are they gonna do for for that stuff? What are they gonna replace the Miiverse stamps with? You know, a, a, bl a blue rupee, huh? Wow, bombs, bombs and a blue rupee. But there is a nice thing in here too. Oh. Hooray! But yeah, that's definitely something to, uh, to consider. Can I- what? Why is that even there? <laughs> like, I guess that they just have to replace it with, like, rupees. I mean, what was in the- those- these chests before? Because I don't think they just in invented these chests for- for the Wii U version, so th I think they just had rupees in them anyway. But yeah, it is very odd. I don't know why they haven't put this game in Wind Waker on the damn, damn Switch yet. Can I get this Howling Stone right now? God, why is it so long? Okay, good enough, I guess. Beautiful. Teachings of all past to you. Find me. Alright, so I, I guess he's in the desert, which I think is where we're going next anyway. So, yeah. Hello there, bird. I am Plum. I'm really excited about the latest attraction down here at the lake. What do you hear about it? 
This attraction is about all about puppy and balloons. <laughs> this is voice. It's just Uku's voice. Puppy and balloons as you move towards the goal. It's stupendous. The balloons are worth different amounts of points. Orange one, I mean watermelon one, orange three, strawberry ten. If you break the same type of balloon twice in a row, you get double the points, but only up to ten times. If you hit a wall and fall off, then you get no points. That's right, zero points for you. Press B to start over from the beginning. You know you got something neat. If you hit over 10,000 points, right? Not that you ever will. Well, the game starts as soon as you fly into the air. Yeah. God, here we go. How did a bird set up this game? What? <laughs> Okay, so I'll just take it nice and easy, and then once I start getting strawberries, I'll just stick with those since um, I want to get just strawberries. I think once you get like up to 10 strawberries, like you just immediately get like 5,000 points. Or something, I don't know, the strawberries are pretty cracked. Uh... Biggest challenge is to not hit other... Damn... Fruit. And don't- I'll also don't get hit out of the game. <laughs> like that. <laughs> Why? Why'd that happen? Hey, go fuck yourself, buddy. That was so lame! So, wanna go again? F you. I think I'll just skip the strawberries that were, um... In that, in that little hole there. Just, uh, don't want to hit the watermelons on accident. Oh! Or the orange. No! Oh, maybe, maybe we'll be fine. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Should be fine. Should be fine. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, I think we're screwed. Damn it. Damn it, damn it. That fucking orange. Maybe I will need to risk going through that hole. Hmm, 5,000 points. Never showed anything I'm too amazing yet. Nope, so I'm gonna go again. F you. Man, what kind of sick bastard did this to me? I'll just have to ease into the wall, I think. What is that? What is that? Is it possible? You can't go through there. It's not possible, man. It's just not. Shut up, bird. Bird bitch. I don't know what sick bastard put... <laughs> put this in the game again. It's flying is like... It's just so annoying. <laughs> So far, so good. Okay, we got the points. We got the points. Now we just gotta get to the exit. Hey, you know, might as well pick up some more strawberries on the way. Yeah, how do you like that, huh? How do you like that, stupid bird? What? No way! 40,000 points! <laughs> you got more than 10,000! Wow, here, take this! But don't think I'm giving you this because I like you or anything. Thanks. So you're completely hooked now, aren't you? You need to go get to try to be the high score, don't you? No. Ah, uh, I see. Get out of here. <laughs> Here's that bug we found earlier. 
and a cave. Hooray. Whoa. This cave has actual puzzles in it. That's pretty cool. What? <laughs> okay, that was weird. I guess I was too far away before. Uh, I don't know. die even quicker now that I have the Master Sword. Hooray! Got a new heart. Second row of hearts has begun. Okay, now I finally know what the chest in Goron Mines that I missed earlier was. Um, in the Wii U version, it's a stamp. So I'm assuming that in... that it's just like some rupees in this version, right? What a bizarre, bizarre design choice. Let's make the... Let's make a chest in Goron Mines inaccessible until you get the claw shot. Like what? But let's not like put like a heart piece or anything like actually good in it. Some rupees? You get bomblings now. I don't really know if I want to. Whoa, now it's you. Yep, well, I finally got my entire bomb repertoire back in order. And ain't they a bunch of buttes? All right, now take a gander at Mr. Barnes, Master Barn. Walk around and blow up all on their own. That's weird. I guess since I have three bags, I'll fill one of them up with it. Man, they are quite expensive. Doubt I'll be using those anytime soon. Well, uh, that's actually it for everything besides the, um, Poe collection. I guess I will do that, uh, at some point, and I'll just put it at the end of this video. I think that that's, that'll work best. So... Here, now, if I actually did what I said I am going to do, he, here now is me collecting pose 3 through 29. Enjoy. Enjoy this hypercut. Well, that was crazy, wasn't it? I, I say, not having done it yet. <laughs> Thank you for watching this episode of Twilight Princess. Next time, we will go to Gerudo Desert, I suppose. And, uh, you know, get to, get to the dungeon there, probably. So next episode will be getting to the dungeon, and then the episode after that will be the dungeon, probably right by the way i hope you enjoyed i'm enjoying this game so far it has a lot of cool little goodies in it a lot of random little things it's pretty fun it's pretty enjoyable the side content certainly isn't isn't up to the level of majora's mask for me but then again i don't know if any Z a zelda game could possibly be up to the level of majora's mask in terms of the side content for me but i still enjoy some of it nonetheless um i really like the golden bugs just because Agatha has the most deranged dialogue of all time when you give her the bugs. Anyway, thank you for watching. I'll see you again soon with more Twilight Princess. Pona's freaking out back there. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.